Hey guys, it's Bethany, your Crafty BFF, and today I am on with a project share, just a small one. Um, this is what I made for my friend Franny. Uh, she is hosting a 2K uh, challenge giveaway over on her Instagram. Her uh, handle over there is at SugarArtGirl. She has um, ordered some labels from me in the past, and um, we've we've uh, been able to talk, you know, chat back and forth some. So when I saw that she was hosting a challenge giveaway, I knew I had to enter. And I honestly, I was like so bored. I think she posted it yesterday, and I was like looking for something to craft for because these days I really need a reason to craft. I need a challenge or a swap to be crafting for, you know. Uh, so, um she the only thing she's actually requiring is a memory dex card because she wants to fill her Rolodex uh little contraption up with um her with memory dex cards from people with their information on the back. Um However, there are some ways to get bonus entries, like a sequins mix, wire wrap beads, sewn paper ruffles, handmade flowers, handmade bows, and she'd like the uh, flowers and bows to be like a small to medium size, and then also um, cut in plain or specialty cardstock, no pattern paper, so that she can use them with any collection. So, I um, had already already had this little mini uh, loaded bag. I have a tutorial for this here on my channel. Um, in fact, this is the one that I made during the tutorial. <laughs> and um, I'm pretty sure anyways, it's this one or one of the other ones I have. So, I already had it ready to go. And I'm going to use my mini albums that I made in this in the mini swap I'm hosting. So I figured I would load this up with the goodies that she is asking for and send it her way. So let's start here. Well, you can see I did decorate the pocket here. I added some snow, uh, not snow, uh, pom-pom trim at the top. I used some of this fun pink mesh in the background, layered a tag that I sewed on, this floral ephemera piece, a little rainbow. I even added an eyelet to the tag. There's a ticket back there and then this puffy sticker on top of a paper ruffle that says this moment. I also added that pom-pom trim to the top, uh, the tall pocket as well. So let's start here with this little card that I made. I did just make a 4x4 four four note card and made an envelope to go with it. I did use a pink Velcro dot um, so the envelope can be reused. I left the card blank so that um, she can reuse the card as well and just wrote a note on this little paper here. Um, real simple card. Um, I cut the card stock at four by eight, scored at four inches to make it, you know, a little note card. And then just, so I cut the, uh, matting layer at three and seven eighths by three and seven eighths sewed around it, added some of this pink mesh, this floral ephemera, and this happy puffy sticker, and called it a day. I, you know, I'm not much of a card maker, but I can throw one together when I need to. Um, here is my memory dex card. Um, I got this die for this memory dex uh, card on Timu, and um, it's it, it has a a pretty fun scalloped border and then but it's pretty simple too. used one of the pattern papers from the collection added some of that pink mesh in the background because guys I ordered this huge roll of it from Amazon for like 11 bucks and look how much is on this roll I will never get through this so I think I'm going to share some of this with Franny as well because why not I'm going to start sharing it with a lot of people because I have so much of it but anyways there's my memory dex card that was the one requirement and everything else is just bonus entries I had um some I had a couple sequins mixes that that weren't that didn't have a lot left to them I mixed them together and came up with this mix and I think it's really pretty 
Um, so, like I said, uh, two small amounts of a sequin mix, and but it wasn't neither was enough to fill a little baggies. But I mixed them together, and I think it turned out pretty darn fun. So there's that. Um, I'm reusing this little uh, zipper bag that someone gifted me in Happy Mail. They decorated it with this little butterfly and um, applique piece there. But then I filled this with wire wrap beads, some that I've wire wrapped, and then others that I've gotten in Happy Mail. So that's fun. I also created eight handmade flowers. I, I used um, my biggest flower punch but it still makes pretty small flowers they're definitely less than an inch um around um but i used some pink textured cardstock added these little metal uh stamens and then added the little rhinestone in the center for the center of the flower um next i did do some sewn paper ruffles because that was one of her um asks just made a simple bag topper with this rosette and a couple of puffy stickers and then last but not least i have these pink bows that i made using my favorite concord and mine's bow dye i did i did the medium size um and yeah i just added those darker pink enamel dots to the center it already has the sewing detail embossed into the bows so love that cut out a piece of this um pattern paper as the backing and called that a day so there is my little entry for franny's uh 2k challenge giveaway over on instagram congratulations franny for getting to 2000 i'm not, definitely not even at a thousand yet so congratulations i hope you like what i'm gonna send you and i wish you luck on um when you get many entries into your challenge all right guys thanks so much for watching if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments down below and i will get back to you other than that have a great day. Bye.